The reminders are still there. Flowers and pictures for a family of five hit near a bus stop on Boulder Highway in April. A father and teenage boy killed. That crash, one glaring example of how dangerous it has been on our roads in 2024. Already, 40 pedestrians have been killed. Compare that to the same time last year when the number was 24. Aaron Breen is director of UNLV's Vulnerable Road Users Project, who says road design must be a part of the conversation. In fact, NDOT is currently looking at possible changes for Flamingo from Pecos to Paradise. Flamingo Road in 2023 was closed a total of two solid days when you add up all the times it was closed for a fatal crash. Just ask yourself, what does that do to my commute? And be grateful that you or someone you love weren't one of them. Breen says changes could include the narrowing of travel lanes, center running transit, and protected bicycle lanes.